Good evening to you both. That Naugatuck police officer who was shot last night was sent to the hospital but is now home recovering. Now he's part of a safety task force that spans several towns and cities in the area, which is why he was in the Brass City last night in the first place. And tonight, Waterbury police officers are looking for the person or people who they say shot him. A close call for police in Waterbury Wednesday night. This is a very, very active investigation and currently ongoing. Just after 10 p.m., officers in the Connecticut State Police Violent Crimes Task Force were conducting an undercover surveillance investigation. That's when someone started shooting at them. The bullets hit their car and a Naugatuck police officer who was behind the wheel. That officer is now home from the hospital. We thank the medical staff and the ambulance and the officers that were on scene to provide uh, first aid to that police officer. Naugatuck police posting this on Facebook saying, quote, it is situations like these that remind us all of the dangers our jobs may entail as we put on our uniforms each day. And we are thankful our officer is recovering. All I heard is sirens going by on Chase Parkway. And my daughter did her some gunshot. Juan Caceres lives just down the road from where this all happened. As police searched the area, they've stopped at his door. And I know pretty much all the neighbors around here, but I don't know what kind of investigation the police were doing. So. It is worries me a little bit. That investigation is one spanning across six police departments in the area, all part of the same task force. Now, police won't say if the person who shot at the officers is the one they were surveillancing, but they do say they'll stop at nothing to find them. We have members of the state police in town with us today. Uh, members from uh, our, our uh, federal partners are on their way into town, uh, and we are going to be working this investigation throughout the day. Now, right now, police are not releasing any suspect or suspects informations at this information rather at this time. And they're also not releasing the name of that Naugatuck police officer who was shot because they're an undercover cop. So they're doing that for his safety. They do say, however, if they have any information, they'll let us know. In the meantime, if you saw anything, give Waterbury police a call. We're live in Waterbury tonight. Julia LeBlanc, Fox 61 News.